everybody. My name is Kate and I am going to talk to you about something very important today. Um, I'm going to talk about, well, first of all, yeah, I'm going to talk about abortion. Um, it's a very important thing because it's a great blot that's on our country, and it's a horrible thing that goes on, and I just want to talk about that for a second. Um, I want to preface this by saying that if you have had an abortion, or, um, yeah, if you've had an abortion, um, that what you did is very, very wrong, and I'm not going to try and hide that from you. It's wrong. Absolutely. But if you turn to Jesus and repent and put your faith in him and choose to follow him, you will be saved. You will be forgiven, and God loves you, and you will have eternal life. It won't undo what you did. But you will get to see your baby again one day. And I want to say that I have empathy for you. Because I, I cannot imagine um, what you must be going through. So, But this, this is generally not aimed at you if, if you are in that situation. So anyway. Um, so, yeah. Alright, so. Let's talk about abortion. I'm going to give a basic argument, pro-life argument, and then um, using deductive reasoning, reasoning, it's going to be very factual. Uh, trigger warning, <laughs> if, you're a, if you're a liberal or anyone who can't handle facts, this is not the video for you. You might want to go somewhere else because I'm going to talk about stuff and you might not like it. So I'm going to I'm going to give basic reasoning arguments, you know, and then we'll see how much time we have and maybe I can uh, counter some other arguments if I don't get the chance to because my camera runs out of t time. Uh, then I will simply make another video later and you can post all your angry I hate pro-lifers or I want women to have equal rights, you know, that sort of thing. You, all, all your pro-abortion or, um, or pro-choice arguments down there, you can put whatever, you know, I'm just going to call you people that oppose, have an opposing viewpoint because, I mean, some of you actually celebrate abortion, some of you think it's an awful thing, but you don't want to make it illegal, you know, so I'm just going to say people of opposing viewpoints uh, on this issue. So, alright, let's get into it. Alright, premise one, if you don't know how to do deductive reasoning, look it up. I'll maybe do one later if you ask me nicely. Okay, so, premise one. He or she that um, occupies the womb is a living, an innocent, and defenseless living human being. Okay, that's, that's premise one. Premise two. Abortion kills that which occupy he or she who occupies the womb. Conclusion. Abortion kills an innocent, defenseless human being who is alive. Obviously, you can't kill someone who's dead. Okay, so now it's time for the second argument. Okay, I did the first argument and it leads right into the second argument. So, premise one. Killing an innocent human being who is defenseless is always wrong. That's, that's premise one. Premise two. Abortion kills an innocent, defenseless human being who is alive, obviously. 
because you can't kill someone who's dead. That doesn't make any sense. Okay, and conclusion, abortion is wrong, okay? So that's, that's my basic arguments. Okay, now let's talk about opposing viewpoints. So opposing, opposing people with opposing viewpoints generally disagree with premise one of the first argument or premise one of the second argument. I disagree with premise one of the second argument in one case that I know of. Just one. And and that's the case of an ectopic pregnancy, um, specifically a tubular pregnancy. That's when the baby is not in the womb. It's like in the fallopian tube or in the ovary. It's a very, 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 very sad thing. Uh, some, some, that's the tub tubular is in the fallopian tube, which is when it's most common. But there are also, um, there, there are also sometimes they'll, they'll implant in the gut or something and it's awful and it's terrible and it, it's probably one of the saddest situations ever. So in that, and in that case, both of them will almost 100% die. So... I mean, that's, that's the one case where, I mean, if you have a good reason, I, I mean, I'm willing to listen, but I think that's the one case where I don't think, like, removing the baby is wrong.